What's up guys? This is Damien with Hosh Online again. And today we're going to be doing I don't like to call them reviews, but because, you know, reviews are so subjective, I like to call it an overview. So today we're going to be doing an overview of uh, the Frankenstein's Ego 10X V3 uh, ROM for the Epic 4G Touch uh, brought to you by Epic Revolution for Android Group, uh, short short name ERA. Um, now first up uh, we're going we're gonna to talk about some of the specs on this. This is an FETN FE10 deal deck stand ICS themed ROM which has the which is this is really nice the 360 300, 360 degree rotation which is pretty nice not all ROMs have that it's also has a boot animation zip support um, you know the, the biggest takes from this are that it it doesn't include a lot of apps um, which in turn it is very fast it's a very fast ROM and you know with every ROM there's kind of kind of a signature you know there's they, they have a lot of things in common you know from ROM to ROM but each ROM has you know a signature thing that you know you kind of take from that ROM and I would say from this ROM the signature thing would be speed it, it's very fast it's very fluid um, it, you know, I don't, I don't, I don't want to say for sure, but I'm pretty sure this is probably the smoothest and fastest ROM I've tried out for the Epic 4G Touch. Um, it, it definitely is, you know, there it's missing apps, but you know they they do bundle them and you can flash them if you need them. I'm not sure if that will take away from some of the speed that you have on this ROM, which you know if it did, it would be a shame because. You know, this has actually become my daily driver because of the speed. I mean, it's just so fluid, you know, with the apps and well, scrolling through the app drawer and, you know, from launching apps, you know, it, it's it's just very, very fluid. It includes uh, Apex Launcher, which, um, you know, I'm usually a fan of Nova Launcher, but, you know, I'm starting to starting to fall for Apex Launcher. Uh, and this ROM has a lot to do with that. Um, it, it's just, you know. I really don't know how to put it. it just feels better you know I don't know if it's just on this ROM or, or what I haven't had a chance to try Apex on maybe you know like one of Midget's ROMs or you know Calkins but it, it, it's a pretty good good ROM I mean good uh, home home replacement app uh, it's definitely up there at least with Nova Launcher um, you know it might even actually have a few more settings that you can tweak uh, than uh, Nova Launcher does, but you know, back to the ROM. You know, the ROM is very fast and stable. Um, I haven't had any uh, force closes, n anything like that. You know, it's very stable. Um, I, I would almost say, if it, you know, when we to go back to the signature, um, you know, thing that we would take out of this ROM would be speed, speed and stability. Definitely speed and stability. Battery life, not bad at all. You know. Um, I take my ROMs and you know I, I hit the gym a lot so when I go to the gym I might if I'm on 100% and I you know I work out and I listen to Pandora and I'm checking uh, text messages and uh, you know my RSS feeds while I'm you know doing my gym thing by the time I usually leave the gym and this is maybe two hours I'm usually at about 20% yeah, I know that sucks, but you gotta you gotta understand. I'm I'm using a lot of apps, and I'm I'm definitely a power user. Uh, on this ROM, I'm usually at about forty percent, you know, which is a big increase for me. Uh, I, you know, and that 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 counts for a lot, you know, because with the you know these devices now, they're not known for the greatest battery life. So any extra bit that you can squeeze out of it, you know, is a definite plus. Um, it comes with the uh, what is this this is the uh, it's, it's not it's a stock browser but you know I've tried the stock browser before and it just never seen this fluid like let's try and gadget you know it's just very fluid and stable and you know this is of course the mobile site but if we rec we request request the desktop site Nah, you know what let's just try and catch it do 
Mobile.com and go there. No mobile. No mobile. We don't want any. But, you know, regardless, let's try The Verge. Some of my favorite sites to go to. You see, but you, as you can see, it's, it's just very smooth. Very, very smooth. I'm re requesting the desktop site. The Verge always has a problem loading on, on mobile devices. I don't know what it is, like the way the website is set up or not. It's probably because we're, we're getting a desktop site, though. But, you know, very smooth. It's, it's just a very good ROM. I mean, as far as stability and speed, everything you could ask for. Uh, oh, let's try another thing that would probably be important. Is while I was... Ah! While I was out, you know, I did a few speed tests around the city, and I get a pretty good 4G signal where I live, which is, you know, uh, uh, Inland Empire, California, which is, you know, a, a bit west of LA. And pay no attention to this, this was on Wi Fi. But um, as you can see, I'm getting two megs, four, you know, I I'm getting pretty good speeds. And this is on the, you know, FETN uh, kernel and modem, so. You know, that's definitely live. I can live with that. You know, I can live with that any day. That's maybe one thing with um, Miz's Slim and Trim ROM and some of the other ROMs. I didn't get that great, great of speeds while while out and about. Uh, of course, you can always flash. You know, pretty much any kernel or modem with any ROM. Uh, you know, it's kind of, eh. You know, will it work? Will it won't? You know, uh, but. You know, it, it, that's up to you, you know, but I, I usually like to stick with what the developer has included in the ROM because that's what they included. You know, you can you can hit the forums and they'll, you know, get some advice on, you know, what what's working a little bit better than others. But for the most part, I, I stick with what the developer included with the ROM. But, yeah, this is basically an overview now, like I said, I don't like to call them reviews because reviews are subjective and I, I, I'm not really trying to review these ROMs. It's um, maybe you decided that you wanted to flash uh, a ROM to your your device or you wanted to root and you want to maybe see a, a visual of what this ROM might look like, how it might operate, you know, on your device. That That's basically what this is. You know, I, I, I want to give some facts of what is uh you know factually included in the rom and along with you know just my impressions of things and uh that's what this been this is so once again this is the frankenstein uh rom ego frankenstein's ego 10x v3 uh brought to you by epic revolution for android great group era group um and it's running the fet and kernel and modem great great rom great rom of uh, you won't be disappointed by it uh go ahead and give it a try let me know in the comments how you feel about the rom and uh do me a favor and go ahead and subscribe if you enjoyed the video or any of hosh online's videos uh, until next time peace